Welcome back to Grace Daily Motivation, the channel where we strive to provide you with empowering content to help you live your best life. In today's video, we'll be discussing a controversial topic, the Bible's warning about not trusting women who do a certain thing. Yes, you heard that right. The Bible has warned us about a particular behavior that we should be wary of when it comes to women. So, without further ado, let's dive into the topic. Context of the Bible It's important to acknowledge that the Bible was written in a different time and context than today. The warning we are discussing today may seem discriminatory or sexist towards women, but it's essential to understand the historical context of the Bible. In the Bible, women were often viewed as property, and their worth was tied to their virginity and their ability to bear children. The Bible's warnings about promiscuity must be viewed in this context. Proverbs 23, 27, 28. The Bible warns us about women who are loose or promiscuous. In Proverbs 23, 27, 28, it says, For a prostitute is a deep pit, and a wayward wife is a narrow well. Like a bandit she lies in wait and multiplies the unfaithful among men. The Bible is warning us about women who engage in promiscuous behavior and are unfaithful in their relationships. This warning is not meant to condemn all women, but rather to caution against the specific behavior of promiscuity. The warning is not exclusive to women. It's essential to note that the warning in Proverbs is not exclusive to women. Men who engage in promiscuous behavior are also cautioned against. In Proverbs 6, 26, 29, it says, For by means of a whorish woman a man is brought to a piece of bread, and the adulteress will hunt for the precious life. So it's not just women who are warned against engaging in promiscuous behavior. The Bible's warnings about promiscuity apply to both men and women. Defining Promiscuity Promiscuity can be defined as engaging in sexual activity with multiple partners without any long-term commitment. This kind of behavior is often viewed as reckless and irresponsible. Promiscuous behavior can lead to physical and emotional consequences, including broken relationships, heartache, and even diseases. The Effects of Promiscuity The effects of promiscuity are widespread and can lead to long-lasting consequences, Promiscuous behavior can lead to the spread of sexually transmitted diseases, unwanted pregnancies, and emotional consequences such as low self-esteem, anxiety, and depression. These consequences can have a profound impact on a person's life and relationships. Application in today's context The warning in Proverbs is relevant today because we can see the effects of promiscuity in our society. The rise of hookup culture and casual sex has led to an increase in promiscuous behavior. It's essential to be aware of the warning and strive to make wise choices in our relationships. Engaging in promiscuous behavior can have lasting consequences that can impact our lives and relationships. Promiscuity and the Objectification of Women Promiscuity can also contribute to the objectification of women, leading to a culture where women are reduced to objects of pleasure rather than respected as individuals with dignity and worth. Promiscuous behavior can lead to the objectification of both men and women, but women are often more vulnerable to this kind of treatment due to societal expectations and gender roles. The Bible's warning about promiscuity can be seen as a call to respect and honor women as individuals with inherent value and worth. The Importance of Trust in Relationships Trust is the foundation of any healthy relationship, whether it's a romantic relationship, a friendship, or a professional relationship. Engaging in promiscuous behavior can lead to a breakdown of trust in relationships, which can be difficult to repair. It's essential to be mindful of our actions and how they may impact our relationships with others. The Dangers of Judgment It's important to note that the Bible's warning about not trusting women who engage in promiscuous behavior does not give us license to judge or condemn individuals who have made mistakes. We should strive to approach others with compassion and understanding, recognizing that we are all flawed and in need of grace. The Bible calls us to love and care for one another, even when we may not agree with each other's choices. 
Choosing wisely. In light of the Bible's warning about promiscuity, it's important to choose our partners wisely. We should strive to build relationships with individuals who share our values and are committed to building a healthy long-term relationship. It's important to take the time to get to know someone before engaging in sexual activity and to have open and honest communication about our expectations and boundaries. Healing and Restoration For those who have engaged in promiscuous behavior in the past, it's important to remember that healing and restoration are possible. The Bible offers a message of hope and forgiveness, and we can find healing through our faith and the support of others. It's never too late to make a change and start living a healthier, more fulfilling life. In conclusion, the Bible's warning about not trusting women who engage in promiscuous behavior should be viewed in its historical and cultural context. The warning is not meant to condemn all women, but rather to caution against a specific behavior that can have lasting consequences. It's essential to be mindful of our actions and how they may impact our relationships with others, and to choose our partners wisely. Ultimately, the Bible's message is one of love and forgiveness, and we can find healing and restoration through our faith and the support of others. Thank you for watching this video, and we hope that you found it thought-provoking and empowering. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more inspiring content.